see a young nigga win, but they gon' love me when I'm gone. If they ain't turned to my shit right now, I bet they play it when I'm gone. When I'm gone. <laughs> did one it's inside the it's all taken apart already but i basically want to show you guys really quick with the oem light basically you're going to want to take off these three screws pull this apart there's a clip you're going to disconnect all this from here disconnect all the pieces take these out there's a wire that runs through here i'll show you guys that when i take it apart right now but you have to run it all the way up there to connect to your low beam light so you want to take off all this stuff i'll show you the pieces you're going to take off right now So now that you got this piece off, pull it apart. Unclip this and undo this screw right here and this piece comes off. Then you're gonna start pulling out the rest of the ballast, and the light bulbs and the string that comes with it. Basically you're gonna pull all this way, all the way out. So I'll show you the pieces right now that I took apart and don't forget the light bulb. And really quick man, before I go any further, I need to hurry up and do this so it can start drying, but I have to drill a hole in the back of this. This is the piece that goes behind here, okay? It's right there. I need to drill this so I can attach the demonizing and basically glue. After I put the wire through, I need to put um, the silicone on it. That way it's completely sealed off with the wire going through for the demonizing connector. So I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna do that right now. So I'm gonna let that dry overnight, then I'm gonna come back tomorrow and finish the install, you guys. So it is gonna be a day delayed. A day delayed, and this is why. But I'm gonna finish putting the rest of the lights together. So yeah, stay tuned. These are the pieces that you need to take off and run through the other light in order to have your low beams. And the reason I have to take apart the OEM lights and put the ballast and everything is because the spec Ds don't come with ballast or anything. So you have to run the wire through here and back out through the top and then connect that piece that you took off down here where you took this off because this just replaces the ballast so i'm gonna do that so basically you're gonna run this wire through the top of it down and make it pop out the bottom right here because this is what connects this bottom piece connects back to the ballast this goes to the top low beam so that's what we're gonna do right now is drop the the cord down in there it's not an easy job but we can get it done guys I'll connect this back to the ballast. Don't forget the light bulb. That's what I'm gonna put in right now. That's pretty easy, so you guys don't have to see me do that. But I'm gonna show you guys anyways. So there's a little hole inside here that actually lines up with this little piece hanging off the side. You just have to stick it straight in there and it goes in there perfect. And just take the pins. Okay, so now basically it's time to Plug the demon eye into the back and hook up the rest of the ballast to the light so we can turn them on and put them in. Stay tuned for the video, you guys. 
So basically I got the lights put put back in. I'm about to screw them all back in, but basically there's just that one plug in the back you guys seen in the beginning. Plugged it back in. Pretty self-explanatory. Let me know what you guys think so far. So good. I'm gonna power them on, hook up the demonize, and then show you guys that. And this is probably gonna be the end of the video and I'm gonna get it edited. So that's why you guys need to smash subscribe if you guys wanna see the final look of everything put together. I'm probably gonna try to get everything on tonight for the most part. And if I don't, eh, it's all good next week so stay tuned Alright you guys, the install is finished. I don't have hella room in here. I apologize from the wall to the car, but both of the eyes are demon eyes are hooked up. Um, I'm about to show you guys right now, man. Uh, I'm hella juiced. <laughs> I'm waiting for my girl to come out here so I could have her uh, get in the car and turn on the lights and we can test them out and I can show you guys. So yeah. Turn the lights off. Lights off. Turn on the blinker. Nismo bumper, just gotta drill the holes, you guys. Stay tuned for that video. That's the next thing going on in the car. Let me know in the comment section, man, what do you guys think about it? Clean or what? Sheesh. I'm excited as fucking happy I finally did this shit and got it installed, man. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Uh, and if you trolling me, I seen a couple, couple of thumbs down, man. Go ahead and keep putting the thumbs down. I ain't mad at you, bro. But, man, for those of you that like the video, man, and this is your first time watching, subscribe. There's hella more content coming on the G35 for surely. Uh, yeah, just let me know what you guys think, man. I'm hella juiced. I can't wait to get the bumper done. Basically, I got to drill the hose in there, and I'm kind of skeptic because I need to make sure this shit's on point. So I need to test fit it and all that. It's late right now, like 10-something, and I still need to go buy some food at the grocery store. So it's the end of the video, man. Let me know what you guys think. I finally did it and put these motherfuckers in. I'm juiced. Till the next video, you guys. Your boy's out. And this whip cost a hundred down Back then she didn't want me, but she on me now And this whip cost a hundred down Back then she